The Yellow Crazy Ant, a tiny terror. Amidst the lush landscapes of the world's tropical regions, a tiny yet destructive force has silently crept in. The Yellow Crazy Ant, scientifically known as Anaplolopus gracilopes, a name inspired by their frenetic movements, is far from benign. In fact, it has earned its place on the list of 100 of the world's worst invasive species, formulated by the International Union for Conservation of Nature. Originating from West Africa or Asia, these invasive ants have unwittingly found their way to various corners of the globe. From Hawaii to the Seychelles and Zanzibar, they've invaded ecosystems, leaving a trail of environmental destruction in their wake. These ants are not typical predators. They've formed a symbiotic alliance with scale insects, notorious plant pests. Scale insects feed on tree sap and produce honeydew, a sugary liquid that ants consume. In return, the ants zealously protect these pests from natural enemies, ensuring their survival and spreading them among trees. This mutualistic relationship might seem intriguing, but it has severe consequences. As the ants protect scale insects, the honeydew not consumed by them drips onto trees, fostering the growth of sooty mold, which tarnishes the leaves and stems. This black mold reduces the health and vigor of the affected plants. The forest canopy has transformed as scale insects tended by yellow crazy ants, multiplied and killed mature trees. However, the most profound impact of these ants is on the biodiversity of Christmas Island. They've set off a catastrophic chain reaction, decimating land crab populations. Land crabs, crucial to the island's ecology, dig burrows, turn over soil and fertilize it with their droppings. Their decline has allowed seedlings to flourish and altered the forest structure, paving the way for weed invasion. Christmas Island red crabs, iconic to the island's ecosystem, have been virtually wiped out in infested areas. These ants occupy their burrows, killing and eating resident crabs, and even using their burrows as nest sites. This mass displacement of crabs has made their annual land migrations perilous. Christmas Island is a focal point for international control efforts, as these supercolonies spread far and wide, posing the greatest known threat to the island's biodiversity. While steps are being taken to curtail their influence, the battle against these tiny terrors rages on. Australia, too, has not escaped their grasp, with infestations in Queensland and the Northern Territory. The wet tropics of Queensland Rainforest, a UNESCO World Heritage Site, has been infiltrated by these ants, posing a significant threat. As climate models predict the spread of these ants across northern Australia, their economic impact is also being assessed. A 2012 analysis by the Queensland government estimated potential economic costs of over $3 billion, if not addressed. This staggering figure doesn't even account for the potential impacts on Australia's biodiversity. The yellow crazy ant may be small, but its devastating influence on ecosystems is immense. The lesson learned from this tiny terror is a powerful one. Invasive species, no matter their size, have the potential to wreak havoc on the delicate balance of our natural world.